Hello class, welcome to the Minute Math YouTube channel. Please hit the subscribe button below and share our videos. You can also find great math content and links to all of our videos at www.minutemathtutor.com. All right now, enjoy the lesson. Hi, I'm Sean Gannon and this is Minute Math and today we're learning about the least common multiple. We're going to find the LCM of each. So, if I was given these numbers, 28 b squared, 20 a times b, and or a b to the third power, excuse me, and 16 b to the fourth. All right. So first thing I do is deal with my largest number, which is 28, and I go through its multiples. So I have 28 here, and I go through its multiples and find the first multiple that's divisible by 20 and 16. Okay. This is going to take a while. So 28, 56. Nope. 84, I don't think so. 112, nope. 140, nope. 168, no. Keep on going. 196 does not. 224 does not. 252 does not. 280 does not. 308 is the next one, but it does not. And 336 does not as well. Okay? 364 fails. 392 fails. 420 fails, 448, uh, nope, 476 does not, 504 does not as well, so let's keep going, 532 does not, but 560, believe it or not, is the first number that can be div is divisible by 20 and 16 of our list of the multiples of 28. So, 560 divided by 20, is 28, okay, kind of makes sense, 28 times 20 is 560, and 560 divided by 16 is 35, okay? So we have the number that we need here, which is 560, so now we define the variables, we have to encompass the most, okay? We have two b's here, three b's here, and four b's there, so we have to get the most, b to the fourth power. Now, the other variable, a. Zero a's, one a, zero a. So we bring in one a, and so my final answer here is just 560 b to the fourth power a. Oh. Quick recap, we're given 28 b squared, 20 a b to the third power, and 16 b to the fourth, and we have to find the LCM of that. Well, from there, I go through the multiples of 28 and find the first one that's divisible by 20 and 16, which took me a while, but got me to 560. That was the first one that could do it. So we got 560 there, and so that's our number. Now we encompass all of our variables, and so my final answer here is just 560 b to the fourth power times a. Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, the creator of Minute Math, and if you like this video, please hit the like button that's right there. If you have a mathematical question, just add it to the comment section below. And lastly, if you want to see more videos just like this one, hit subscribe. It's right there. But as always, thanks for watching.